Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. It's time for Great Wars the Truth Destiny Chapter 5. Thanks to the hype of the system that made Ye Tuan Chan's favorability towards Gufeng to the maximum level, Ye Tuan Chan's anchor succeeded and made her leave the Loan Treasure Pavilion voluntarily. She will also come back later to repay her slow ones. After that, Gu Feng met the captains of Chen Long army. Since he was late for the meetings, Gu Feng intended to give the captains of the three battalions a gift as an apologize. However, Gu Feng didn't seize the captain of Spasi battalion, Fang Feng Shui. Since Gu Feng had also never met Fang Feng Shui before, Stewart Wu gave Gu Feng a portrait of Fang Feng Shui. Gu Feng then guessed that Fang Feng Shui was a lady. Elsewhere, a woman is beating up a man who has a bigger body than her. After the warm-up exercise is over, she then intends to meet the prodigal sons with surname Gu. The woman turned out to be Fang Feng Shui's. Captain Battalion C of Chen Long Army. Due to the presence of Fang Feng Shui, Lu Zhen's Captain of C Battalions asked for the demisting to be postponed to another time. However, Fang Feng Shui suddenly appeared. Because Gu Feng had summoned her, Fang Feng Shui deliberately prepared a gift. Fang Feng Shui gave Gu Feng a coffin. She didn't know whether the gift was suitable suitable for Gu Feng or not.
hearts like glass We're stretched across a million miles Echoes from the past Getting fainter every day We were more than friends The king and queen of all the wild We'll live it all again When the ice melts back away Here we stand up in arms This is home where we are Ever strong in the world that we made I still hear you in the breeze See your shadows in the trees Holding on memories never change Thank you.